In this lesson, let's clear up the difference between weight and mass, considering the importance of gravitational force. We often refer to weight. We mention the weight of a suitcase, the weight of flour in a recipe, or perhaps how much weight a person has gained or lost. Well, a lot of the time, we're using the word wrong. We use the word weight when what we really mean is mass. But aren't they the same thing? To understand the difference, we'll refer to one of the most famous formulas in physics, Newton's second law of motion. F equals ma. The net force acting on an object of mass, m, is given by mass times acceleration. Mass in this equation refers to an inherent property of the object, a measure of how much matter it contains, usually measured in grams and kilograms. We all know if we jump up, we'll free fall back down. Something pulls us or attracts us to the Earth. Consider an object that is free falling under gravity. The acceleration, A, experienced by this free falling object is called the acceleration due to gravity, G, and it always points downwards to the centre of the Earth. So, we can adapt the formula, F equals MA, replacing A with G. According to Newton's law of universal gravitation, the net force a free-falling object experiences, F sub G, is equal to the mass of the object times by the acceleration due to gravity, G. F G has the same magnitude as the weight of the object in Newtons. So we can write the equation for weight as W equals M G. As you can see, weight is a measure of gravitational force that depends on two factors, mass and acceleration due to gravity, g. While mass is the same no matter where you are, the weight can vary with the size of g, depending on where in the world you are. We tend to approximate that g has a value of 9.81 meters per second squared. But remember, this is not always the case. g is not the same everywhere. The further you get from Earth, the higher g gets. On Mars, it's around 3.71 meters per second squared. On Jupiter, it's over 24 meters per second squared. Let's take an example. Suppose the mass of a woman is 60 kilograms. Compare her weight on Earth and Mars. Remember, the acceleration due to gravity on Earth is 9.81 meters per second squared, and the acceleration on Mars is 3.72 meters per second squared. We know that the weight of an object of mass m is given as fg equals mg. Inputting the values tells us that on Earth, her weight is 587 newtons, whereas on Mars, she weighs much less, at 223 newtons. In this animation, we learn the difference between weight and mass, and the relevance of gravitational force. Now you know how to use these words more accurately in daily life. Subscribe for more engaging explainers like this.